Hello and what's going on? Welcome to another Shadow PC video. So I got my email about 10.30 this morning letting me know that the additional storage was finally, finally available. So it says, get those games ready. You can now add more storage to your Shadow. That's right. As of today, our new storage management feature is available in your customer account and allows you to, one, add storage. Once ordered, activate your new storage by shutting down windows on your Shadow and rebooting it. Number two, remove storage. Storage removal goes into effect the next time you log in uh, to your Shadow after you perform this action. The price will be calculated on a prorated basis. Warning though, removing additional storage will delete all data on the D-Disk drive. Back up any important data stored on the D drive before removing storage from your account. Obviously, right? Because they're removing that storage, whatever's on there, you won't have access to. And they do say here, please note, due to high demand, we expect quantities to sell fast. And I would not be surprised if it's not sold out while I'm making this video, honestly. Now, I ran into a bug earlier where I went to order it making a, while I was making a video for it and it said it was sold out. So I stopped making the video and I reached out to Shadow um, and they kind of had, had mentioned to me it could be a bug. So after um, reaching out to Shadow Support, they f and while once I reached out to them, I started refreshing my account page and it popped up um, as an option to add storage again. So I quickly added the storage um, and then I got an email right back from Shadow and they said, uh, hello Jerry, thank you for the follow-up. I'm glad that you were able to order the additional storage as it was most likely a small bug. I'll go ahead and close the ticket and reply with further questions. So yeah, for me, and I'll show that in the video, I'll put up a clip here in a minute just real quick where I was sign going to sign up for it and uh, all of a sudden it had said sold out. So if that happens to you, you might want to refresh your page a few times, wait a few minutes. Um, it could just be a bug rather than actually being sold out. And here's that little piece of video earlier where I had logged in to buy the additional storage and it had said it was sold out and this was apparently some kind of bug. So all right, let's jump back over to the uh, to the email. In your email here, you can just click the Add New Storage Now, and uh, this will take you to your account sign-in, or if you didn't get the email yet and you want to check, just go log on to your Shadow account, and you'll see your normal My Subscription at the top, but you're going to see a new area now that they've added in right here. 256 gigabyte is my included so whatever your included package has is here and then you're going to have what you added so i've got the 299 for 256 so unfortunately it's not 299 for one terabyte there were some rumors out there that that might be what the deal would be unfortunately it's 299 per 256 gigabytes so um, my opinion not necessarily the best deal but that will do for me for now because having call of duty 183 gigabytes on shadow doesn't allow me to test any other games or do anything i'm doing with it right now i have to keep deleting uh, call of duty and other games and redownloading them so this will be just enough to help me be able to test more games quicker um, and do some other things but yeah it could get a little bit more pricey i definitely wish it was a little better deal but that's all right so you can go in here now i still have the option to add so i would assume they're not sold out yet add more storage to my shadow you can increase your storage by increments of 256 for 299 a month limited to eight increments um, so they'll show you're included what your total is and then you can just add more right here and then you would confirm and you can also take off storage here and confirm that as well. So that's how that's how the storage management is going to work there. Um, can't wait till Shadow Ghost comes back in. I've reached out to them a couple of times. Um, I'm signed up to find out when they're available again. And they have assured me that they are going to be coming soon, even though they've been saying that for a while, and that we should get those emails letting us know when they're available for order. I will definitely be ordering my Shadow Ghost uh, immediately when it's available, and we will do a little unboxing and setup and testing on the channel. And, uh, and have some fun with that once it's available. But this is how you deal with your, your storage. Now, once you've uh, gone through that process and you've added your storage, now if you're on your Shadow PC, you're gonna to need to shut it down and restart it. If you're not and you're just starting up your Shadow PC, you're gonna be just fine. So let's hop over here where I've already logged on to Shadow and booted it back up. If you click down here to your file explorer and to this PC, you will now see the additional storage. Uh, mine had popped up within just a couple of minutes. 
Um, they say it could take up to 30 minutes to show up, so uh, don't freak out if it's not there right away. Uh, keep checking for it and uh, shut down your, your shadow and reboot it if you need to, and it should show up. But mine was pretty quick, um, 255, so, you know, not quite 256, right? But we're there, 255. Um, you can rename it if you don't want it to be called My Games, but that's what they, that's what they default it to. And there you go. That's your additional storage ready to go inside of your shadow. So pretty cool. I'm glad that they've added this in. I've been waiting for it. It's definitely going to help me out. Um, I do wish it was a little better deal. I mean, I would gladly pay more like $5 a month for a terabyte or uh, maybe the $2.99 per $5.12. Uh, I don't know. Storage is just really, really tough these days with games getting bigger and bigger, um, needing more and more space to have them installed. But Shadow is not my main PC, so I'll be able to get away with this uh, for my game testing and for my uses with Shadow. Um, it's still pretty good. I can't really complain too much about what they've got going on here. And I like the account management um, that they have set up. I like how uh, pretty simple it is to to go into your account, add and remove, and do whatever you want with your storage there. So definitely a good thing. All right, guys, thanks a lot for checking out this video. I just wanted to update you on the additional available Shadow PC storage and let you know what's going on there and how that works. So thanks a lot for checking out the video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Ring that notification bell so you know when I drop a new video. Uh, go ahead and leave your comment below. Let me know if you're signing up for Shadow, thinking about it. Um, have you had it for a long time and love it? Um, let me know down in the comments. And also give the video a thumbs up if you don't mind. It really helps. Thanks a lot. Have a good one and I'll see you next time.